Peggy 18. So Mafia 3, we're trying to achieve something we call Hollywood action driving, which is this feeling that you're pretty much a stunt driver in a Hollywood movie. It's very much inspired by 60s driving movies like Bullet. It's this feeling that you're really good at driving, but you're still sitting in a real car, and that car has mass, it has inertia, it's actually correctly modeled. It's created by designers that have degrees in this kind of engineering. So as you're sitting in this car, you feel like this thing has weight. You can use it to drift around corners, to slam into things. And even as you're driving around the world, which has different surfaces, you might be in the bayou with like wet dirt, you might be on gravel, you might be on asphalt. All of that actually affects the car and you can actually feel that seep into the way you're driving. We come in with this philosophy of all the cars you should be able to get in and immediately be able to kind of like get to grips with them. But then there's a level of mastery as well. After five to 10 minutes, you're really starting to get to grips with the car and push the car to its limits. You're really able to go around the streets of New Bordeaux really quickly, power sliding around corners. You're getting that whole Steve McQueen movie feeling, which is what we really want. 